The McGavick High School Band is trying for their third contest of champions win in a row. Chuck talked with some of the folks from McGavick after their preliminary performance this afternoon. We're trying to get the best out of the symphonic sound, yet do something for the audience. Do something that'll compete and still be entertaining along the same lines as we've done the past two years, Chuck. Is it difficult to, to bring off drill subtleties when the music is, uh, has those different nuances? It's horrible. We've had feet problems all year long, so it's, we're lucky today it hit. A lot of phasing uh, areas that could develop, right? Yeah, we're spread out all over the field, and it seems like it's been the last two weeks that finally that started to tighten down for us, Chuck. So that's a, that's a little bit scary. The next band entering the field for a competition from Nashville, Tennessee, the McGavick High School Band. Directors Rick Murphy and Jeff Beckman. Drum majors Heather Kinsel, Wendy Mays, and Maria Harrington. Music program, music from the American West. Silverado, the Magnificent Seven, Hoedown from Rodeo, the Yellow Rose of Texas, deep in the heart of Texas, and the closer, Battle Hymn.
Gaylord, that was a total package. I mean, they used the field as the stage. They covered it from top to bottom. They gave you nuances in music and nuances in drill. The one effect where they did the silent drill where all we could hear was the click of the rifles and kind of the, the air as it was flowing with the flags and all of a sudden they, they turned and hit the perfection at the end of it. And then even right here at the end, the happy trails to you. I mean, most fans go off the field with a little drum tick. They're going off the field with a little music. Why not? Uh, Chuck, you know, if they win tonight, this will be three in a row. It'll be the first time that has ever happened with a band in the contest of champions. Well, I'll promise you this, it's possible tonight. Well, I have to admit, I may be a bit prejudiced because I am from Nashville. And I had a chill or two run up and down my spine as I watched that performance. They are really, really good. Hot tonight. Chuck, you know, one thing that continues to amaze me is how someone can sit.